<laughs> Hi, I'm Gareth Wilson, lead designer on Blur. You're about to see an exclusive new gameplay video of the team game modes that are available in Blur's multiplayer. In team modes, you earn points that go towards your team's total. Racking up as many points as possible is the goal, as the team with the most points at the end of the event wins. As you can see, the team modes are just a few of the many game modes that we have in Blur. Today, we'll start off by giving you a sneak peek at team racing. So we're in our lobby here, about to jump into a race, and you can see that the lobby is split into two teams. The Omega team, which are coloured in blue, and the Alpha team, who are coloured in yellow. So we're going to jump right into the action here, as we follow the Alpha team on the first lap of this race in Tokyo. We'll give you a view from a few of our races to show you some of the action, as the Alpha team attempts to dominate the Omega team. During the course of the race, players are able to track what team is in the lead using the tug of war bar located in the left corner of the screen. The team with the most colour in this bar is the team currently winning the race. So we'll follow these two races here to give you a glimpse of how working as a team is important. We'll stop the action here to show you a little team tactic. As you can see, the racer in the bottom of the screen is getting pounded and is only one hit away from being wrecked. In order to help his teammate, the racer in the top screen is going to drop his repair icon so his buddy, which is almost wrecked, can repair his car and stay in the race. Thanks to great teamwork, Alpha Team maintains the lead and is that much closer to winning the race. So now we'll take you to another team race that's currently going on in New York. As you can see, the Omega team is winning the battle here as they work together to take out the Alpha team. We'll join this Alpha team racer as he gets his revenge by firing off a couple of bolts backwards to trip up and take out the racers in blue. So now the blue team is behind and in a desperate fight for position. We'll see how the Omega team tries to take the lead by taking out one of the last racers on the Alpha team. In a last second move, Yellow team takes the win, all with the help of a much needed Nitro. After racking up the points per position, Alpha Team walks away with a win by only two points. Great race. Now for a sneak peek at one of our other team game modes, Team Motormash. The same rules apply here. The team with the most points at the end of the event wins, but in Team Motormash you earn points by smashing into your opponents or hitting them with power-ups. We'll break out briefly to show you a few views of some of the chaos. Like in regular Motormash, the objective here is to hit and wreck as many opponents as possible. This game mode is a lot of fun, it's controlled chaos where you have to pull your own weight to help your team take the victory. The primary objective is to take out as many opponents as possible. On the flip side, you also have to keep from getting wrecked. Because if you get wrecked, well then you're just helping the other team win. We hope you've enjoyed this sneak peek of the team events in Blur's multiplayer, and we hope to see you on track to experience powered up racing.